Guess what I did today? Do you see? Sweaty mess. I don't know if you can tell too. This is the, um, remember I told you guys I got a bunch of Nike tops? I gotta say, this kind of keeps the girls in. I'm also, see, I came for a run. I don't even have makeup on, guys. But I gotta tell you, the um, sweat thing, can you see, by the way? You see? I don't know if you can see. 781. I'm almost at 800 calories, strictly uh, running. And then I finished up and I did some of my other stuff, which I'll get to in a minute. Mr. Flow? Mr. Flow? Ah! No idea how great I feel right now. Just, ah! So. And I just had a really great conversation. Um, just have so much to tell you. So, um, by the way, this is my new theme song. That's all there is to it. Love it, and I'm probably gonna post the video so that you can watch it too and love it and download it and whatever. I just, it's such a good mood. I have so much going on, I don't even know where to start. So I went over to do my run, because I've got a busy day later today. Went to the same um, high school thing, which I'm not gonna be going to anymore. I'll explain why in a minute. Um, I think I was going to be ending up on an episode of Cops. I'll get to that in a minute. Um, I ended up talking to a cop. Um, I'm still at 134, and I've been home for a few minutes. Um, I went over there, and um, I really wanted to pace myself, you guys, because like I told you, I knew that I was going too fast with my running, and that's what was making me cramp up. So this time I knew, okay, each lap, each time around the lap, is a third of a mile, right? So I knew that to be, I, I wanted to shoot for like seven or eight miles an hour. Is that right? Am I doing that right? Yeah, seven or eight miles an hour. So I figured it out, don't ask me to do it now because I'll probably screw it up and then people will watch this video and think I don't know math and I'm very good at math. Did you see that? I'm feeling pretty good. I need to be celebrating right now. Um, all that to say, I paced myself I walked around the lap once, and then I ran it three times. So I did a full mile on my own. After one week of running, I did a full mile. That's a big deal for me, you guys, without stopping. And I did kind of start get, getting cramps the last part, but I just pressed through it because they weren't that bad. You know, and I just made sure, I, I find myself wanting to speed up when I'm running, like I still feel like I'm not running. I feel more like I'm jogging. Um, and I think maybe there's that fine line, you know, when you get better at running, I'll be able to do longer strides and faster, but I, I think there must be something to the fact that I've got to get my body used to the pounding and whatever. <laughs> the boobs. But the boobs are fine because I have all these great bras. <laughs> those of you like April, you have no idea what those of us with boobs have to deal with. So, um, what else? Uh, so then, okay, so I did one lap walking, three laps running, one lap walking, three laps running. So I did two full miles today, people. And then, again, it, it's like, it's 12.30. So I went about 11 o'clock, maybe 11.30. And again, it's like 85, almost 90 degrees already. I was really getting hot. And then some guy <laughs> came out of nowhere. Um, and he had a plastic bag. And he's like, I want to run with you. And he only had like five teeth. <laughs> I'm not lying. I'm not making this up. And I'm, I'm not judging people because, but my problem is sometimes in this, area I can be too nice and then I'll find out that he's wanted by the police and you know he's just killed three people or something and I'm like oh he was so sweet he wanted to run with me and they're like yeah that's how he kills people <laughs> so he's sitting there and he's like I can run with you I'm running a marathon and I said well I, I'm here a lot and he's like how about you know tomorrow I'm like I don't know if I'll be here tomorrow I have church in the morning yada 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 and um, he's like well, you know, I'd love to run with you. I'm training for a marathon. And if you don't want to run a marathon, you can sponsor me in the marathon. And I go, okay, well, I'll think about it. I'm, you know, I'm not planning on running a marathon yet. And he's like, well, you know, what's your name? And I go, what's your name? And he goes, I'm the running man. I kid you not. That's what he said. And I'm like, dude, seriously, I'm not going to talk to you if you call yourself the running man. And he said, my name's Alan. So whatever. I went up, I did the stairs once running, got my heart up to heart rate up to like 163 came back down, let my heart rate get back down a little bit, and then I did every two stairs, up and down, um, and I did that twice. Each time I did the stairs, walking and doing every other step, I got my heart rate up to like 175. Kind of funny, because it feels, I don't know, sometimes it feels like you're working harder when you're running up those stairs. Sorry, just feeling funny. Um, so I did that, and then I did 25 walking lunges two times, and then I did, I, I'm gonna see if I can put 
um, part of that video. In Jenny Lynn's first video, she does a lot of track training. And one of the things she does is she'll do sprints halfway down and then walk back. And then she also does where you're kind of um, sidestepping. You sidestep one way, you sidestep the other, but you're running. I did that several times. And I really like that too for getting your heart rate up. I'll try to put the video. It's from Jenny Lynn's first video, The Harder I Work, The Luckier I Get, which if you don't have that and you want inspiration, you have to buy that. It's like 50 bucks. Go over to her website, JennyLynnFitness.com. Talk about inspiring. Every time I watch that, I'm blown away. Um, God, I'm keeping my heart rate up. I'm still at 122. My normal heart rate's like 80. Um, so anyway, did that. Got a good workout. Where am I as, as far as time? I gotta get showered and get, go get going. Hello. I haven't had enough caffeine today. Anyway, so um, that's that. Um, anyway, came home and uh, had a couple, some really exciting news. Um, Work-wise, family-wise, and whatever. Some of it I can't share, some of it I'll share later. Um, but it's just been a really, really good, hectic, crazy week, but good. And I'm just so excited because that was such a big deal for me to run one mile, no stop. The sweat is pouring in my mouth. Um, to run one mile. What if I did a vlog like this? Wah, 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 wah. <laughs> like Charlie Brown. <laughs> it's probably what a lot of you guys do. <laughs> you probably watch my vlogs and you're like, wah, 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 wah. <laughs> So anyway, um, that's that. I um, I have a busy day today, but I'm very, very excited. I still want you guys to give me your, your pointers. Um, you know what I'm curious on, you know, because the whole cramping thing, I seem to be able to kind of deal with it. Like it wasn't as intense this time. I always get it in the same spot. So for me, it's on my right side. Um, do you guys, do you guys, when you run, do you try to focus on breathing? You know, because somebody told me that once, and I think that's kind of a pain to be like, and counting. I just kind of breathe and whatever, you know. So anyway, let me know on that. Um, what else? I tried the Greek yogurt. I need to try it different ways, but that's it. I'm feeling great and I have no doubt that my next photo shoot, are you kidding me? Uh-uh. I'm going to be in my favorite shorts. I'm going to be in my favorite bikini. I'm already looking pretty damn good in my favorite bikini, but there's just a little extra wobble in the back. And I'm talking about the back, not the booty, because my booty is shaping up fine. My legs are shaping up fine. It still is. This is what happens when you get to be old like me. You know, it's like the torso and in this back, this little piece, I, I swear, I wish I could take a saw and just saw it off. Maybe have somebody like run a power saw over my back. There's a new liposuction. I'm going to start doing it, only it hurts. I will talk to you guys later. I hope you have a great, great weekend. I'm sure I will uh, hopefully be blogging tomorrow. Um, I think we're going to do yoga tomorrow. And uh, keep sending me some new um, some new uh, music suggestions. Ken, I know this top has a pocket in the back. Why is there? Is that for my water? You guys, I'm just discovering this live. Is that what you do? You put your water in this pocket in the back? Wow, that sounds like I'm... It kind of sags in the back. I'm not going to turn around because... I don't want you to see my back. Well, plus that looks stupid. There's a pocket in the back of this shirt. Is that what that's for? You runners, you need to tell me. Because with me, I'll probably put a book in there or something. <laughs> Maybe that's for my iPod. I don't have an armband for my iPod. Somebody tell me where to get your iPod. Anyway, Ken, I was telling you, I owe you an email. I haven't forgotten you. I've just been busy. So I will talk to you guys all later. Oh, and Ken, you don't tend to always watch my videos, so you'll have to write that to me. I'll talk to you later. I'm just on and on. Have a great weekend. I'm so excited. I'm just giving myself pats on the back.